Live team coverage tonight, beginning with KCAL 9's Crystal Cruz covering the Lilac Fire. What's the very latest there, Crystal? Hi, you guys. Well, here in Marietta, this evacuation center opened 24 hours for all people affected by the fly fires, including those in San Diego County. And we could start seeing people show up right here to this parking lot with their trailers and their horses because things are ugly down south. The Lilac Fire in San Diego County doing what the Thomas Fire did in Ventura County. A very eerie orange smoky glow off in the distance. You can tell that the fire is still actively burning out here in the Bonsall area. Flames taking over living rooms, destroying homes, including a few rows of mobile homes, devastating lives around the holidays. And there's little firefighters can do when it looks like this. We're getting, these are fully involved. There's nothing we can do about them. We're going to let those burn down to the ground. Once they do, we're going to cool them. We have crews surrounded this whole area. We're going to make a stand and we're going to protect all the ones that we can. At San Luis Rey Downs in Bonzel, tens of thousands of dollars ran from the racetrack. <laughs> An incredible sight, a stampede of thoroughbred racehorses set free, flight instinct triggered. Ben, some horses afraid to run, but it's their only chance at surviving a fire that can race just as fast as they can. A much calmer scene in Murrieta as pets and people head home after evacuating because of the Liberty Fire. We got lucky. I want to say the flames were about a quarter of a mile away from us this afternoon. and. It wasn't looking real good because the wind was really kicking up and the flames were really coming. So, but we just got notified that our area is okay. So, yay! <laughs> And of course, people here in Marietta happy about their homes, but devastated for the folks in San Diego, including those horses. Some of the animals were taken to the Del Mar racetrack. Now you should know race horses, thoroughbred race horses, uh, they have a tattoo under their lips, so their trainers should be able to identify them down the road when they do catch up to those horses who are set free. I'm Crystal Cruz live in Marietta tonight. I'll send it back to you in the studio. Oh.